This is the uh, introductory lecture for the meaning of life unit. So uh, this unit is all about what is the meaning of life, or is there a meaning of life? And you'll notice, I was about to say you'll quickly notice, but it might take some time. You'll notice that it's kind of not really clear exactly what the phrase the meaning of life means. So we talk about this all the time, and we use these phrases all the time, and of course, Many of you voted for this topic. This is one of the popular topics, so you're interested in learning about the meaning of life. But I don't know, it, at least for me, if you start to think about it a little longer, it's not clear exactly what it means for life to have a meaning, what the word meaning means when we apply it to lives as opposed to words. It's clear what the word meaning means when we talk about a word. So what does the word apple mean? Oh, it means the fruit that grows on those sorts of trees and so on. What does life mean? That's, that's a tougher question. So one thing to try to keep your eye on is what kind of question are we trying to answer when we ask what is the meaning of life? This will come up explicitly in some of the later readings, but uh, Camus, at least, our first reading, kind of takes it for granted. So that's one topic. Another topic is, uh, so, our readings are partially coming from this book, The Meaning of Life, A Reader. There's plenty of other stuff in uh, this book if you're interested more in the meaning of life. One thing which I ended up dropping from this unit, so I was planning on including some stuff from this one too, The Meaning of Life and the Great Philosophers, and then another, like, some other stuff too. So, sorry. Um, one of the main other sources was going to be this. We were going to read, um, I think, some Buddhist stuff and uh, from, let's see, Yasa. So uh, we were going to read some sort of other thoughts about the meaning of life, and you'll notice that this book that we were drawing from, oh, and I think we were maybe gonna read Chinese stuff. I can't, I can't remember. Anyways, this book that uh, those were going to be drawn from, um, I don't think it's on Canvas, but you can email me to get it. It's got a lot of other stuff too. So Confucius, Socrates, Plato, Diogenes, uh, Zongzhi, Aristotle, Epicurus, Cola, Epictetus, and lots, lots and lots of views on uh, the meaning of life. So notice uh, there's, there's many options on offer beyond the ones that we're going to look at in uh, the course. And so that's just to say, uh, this is always true with all the topics that we look at, but especially with the meaning of life where there's sort of lots of different approaches from lots of different uh, directions, we're kind of getting a small slice, and our slice is partially focused on the idea of the absurd. Um, sort of Camus sets the stage for that, and so a lot of people are responding to him. Um, but there are sort of non-absurd approaches to the topic uh, that have nothing to do with absurdity, and you can read about those in here and also in this other book if you'd like. So that's just, there's other stuff out there. And uh, that's it. So on to Camus.